What's up everybody, it's your boy Duplace here and I'm back with some more Grand Theft Auto 5 mods for you guys. So today we're doing the Predator mod in GTA 5. As you can see, he has his armor on, his claws, look at his face. I haven't really, I haven't watched the movie yet. And I, and I think I'm going to after making this video. But yeah, let's go ahead and get started. As you can see, the weapons, the armor, the blades, everything. I don't even know what species he is, I really don't. So let's start off. So as you can see we have, we can run a little faster than usual, nothing out of the ordinary though, not a significant amount. And you can do a little a high jump, not impressive compared to what we've seen with other mods. Alright, now let's get started with the abilities. Alright, so if we look at the weapon wheel, you can see shoulder cannon, let me just go through them quickly. Combo, combi stick, disc, shuriken, hook, remove skin and self destruct Okay, we're gonna start off with the shoulder cannon. We just click the mouse button and it fires energy blast. Nothing too impressive. Nothing too impressive really. Just a regular blast. Like I said, this is gonna be a fairly underwhelming video. But yeah. It's almost like a jolt of lightning, if you notice. Oh, can I enter the Flicker Bank? Oh, I can. Let's see if we can rob this. No, I cannot. Alright, let's move on to the next ability. Self-Destruct. Now, he goes down on the floor, the camera zooms out, and watch what happens. It also kills you. As you can see, it kills you, which I forgot about. So this is like a last resort. All right, next ability. All right, remove skin. This is my favorite, by the way. So we have to grab the, the person first. How do I do that? First, so you press R to grab them, and then you pull up the wheel, and you do the remove skin. And then you cut them up. And as you can see, the camera fades out so they can replace the model. Because obviously they're not going to animate that on screen. And as you can see, that's the end result. Let me go in first person. Oh yeah, and we have a visor on our screen. So you can actually see the... I don't know if he's a robot. I don't know. I haven't watched the movie. So yeah, that's the model. It looks really good. What it is. Yeah. Is this a skin? I don't even remember what the person looked like. Alright, let's try it again. On this police officer. Let's try it on him. Oh, I have to actually pull up the weapon wheel to do it. Alright, let's get this guy. Hold on, yeah, I got it wrong again. Alright, here's some more unsuspecting civilians. Let's grab this guy real quick. Remove skin. And as you can see, that's the end result. All the blood disappeared, literally instantly. Alright, so let's move on to the next ability. I don't want to spend too long on each one. Okay, so the next one is hook. So it actually shoots a grappling hook. And I guess I can grapple him to that building over there. As you can see, he's hanging. That, that's going to be very useful going forward. Let's grapple her to that guy. And the rope looks really good too, that's the thing. Hold on, can I grapple cars to cars? Can I though? I don't get the impression that I can. Alright, let's try it on that guy in that green shirt. Yep, so he's he's being dragged by that, that truck. He's gonna get mauled horribly. No women are spared either. Oh, I actually roped those two together. Look at the models as clipping. The game was not designed for this. Oh, he's stuck in the wall too. Yeah, he glitched out there. Look at that. Yep. So he's stuck to that. Him, to him, him, to him, and that. Wait, hold on. Let's see if we can get one of them on the helicopter. Yup. Oh, he's getting dragged by the helicopter. Look at that. That's crazy. Alright, let's move on to the next ability. Alright, so the next ability is Shuriken. As you know, Naruto has Shurikens. Any ninja animated show about, well, ninjas has Shurikens. You just throw a metallic cylindrical object. 
You know what shurikens are. I don't need to explain what shurikens are to you. Does it cut them? I hope it does. Oh, it's in his neck, but it didn't cut his head off. Well, a shuriken wouldn't cut your head off completely. It's not large enough. But you can clearly see the model stuck in that guy there. Yeah, let's just take these wave of guys out. I don't want to get busted and I don't want it to mess with my mod. So, can I, can I do it to the helicopter? Oh, he's still getting dragged. Oh, God. Look at that guy. Look at him go. Where are they? Yup, got him. Where's the final one? Yup. No, that was a car. Right, let's just get these last two done and I'll move on to the next ability. Oh, missed him. All right, next ability. Okay, so interestingly, there's one called Disc. But this is this is less lethal or non-lethal. Well, I don't know. I'm about to find out. Oh, never mind. It kills too. Oh, this one actually did cuts you. It actually chops them up into pieces. You think the shuriken, which is probably sharp, but would be more dangerous? But yeah, this one actually cuts them in half. Look at that. That's crazy. He's still getting dragged. Oh god. One more. Well, now nah, I have to mess with this a little bit. I can't. I can't end that so soon. Come on. Oh, I was aiming at the wrong person. This is more fun than the shuriken. All right, let me just do this last guy. All right, on to the next. All right, the last one is a combi stick, which honestly just looks like a spear. He's still getting dragged. That's, that sucks. Sucks to be him. I, I, I don't think he's even dead. Like, oh, he should be. He should be. There's no way he should be alive. All right, so this is actually the last ability, the combi stick. I'm not sure why it isn't just called a spear. Maybe they call it that in the movie. I don't know. You know what this does? She's still without them, but the thing is, you have to run back over and press Q to pick it up. Oh, one more thing. You can press X to change your vision. Heat vision. X-ray vision. Well, I think that's... This is this is thermal. And this just shows heat signatures of, of people and animals, living things. And then this is some weird green filter. And then that's back to normal. So there's that. There's also invisibility. When I press Q, as you can see, I'm cloaked. Obviously, you can still see me moving, but I would like to believe I'm invisible to them. Am I? Yeah, they do not see me. Yeah, they don't see me. That's really nice. I like that. But they're shooting, though. Can I, can I attack them while they're... <clears throat> oh, nice! I can grab them while doing that. Okay. I should be using the combi stick right now. I'll get to it. Alright, yeah, so let's go back to normal. Combi stick. Yeah, let's just finish this. So yeah, I just I just spare them really. It's like a less efficient disc. Those three abilities feel the same to me. The um the shuriken, the disc, and the combi stick. Can I throw this at a helicopter? Well obviously I can, but I want to see the damage it does. Unless I were able to throw it at the pilot. Not much. At least not on the first throw. Wait, hold on. Why is it throwing that? Oh, I guess that's the combi stick is only for like players, for NPCs. Oh, I actually had it switched to come to the disc. Whoops. Q to pick up. Yeah, so that's all that does. I have to run back for it. That's kind of annoying. I wouldn't use this much or at all, honestly. I can be invisible while throwing it, which is a nice addition. 
so yeah that pretty much concludes the predator mod in gta 5 hope y'all enjoyed this video don't forget to comment like share subscribe turn on post notifications all that good stuff and with that said i will see y'all next time peace